Same way I do, I get stuff, I get it bad. He was on him. He broke. Yeah. I don't know what it is. I think it's a brown one. No, it is. Oh, you know, I've already got one. Oh, this thing's a little big. He might be 15 to hide. Catch one walking them off these little edges. But... You can catch one on that tree. <laughs> is there some on there? Mm. I didn't want to hire him, so. Are they on that tree, huh? Yeah, there's, there's two or three on it. Yeah. They just followed me off of it.
there guys, number five guys. That's a good one. Oh, dude, they're supposed to mash that active target off of it. guys what's up it's the day after the bfl on dale hollow it's it was a pretty good tournament for me i lost a couple key fish throughout the day but had a real good call angler real good net man can't thank him enough for netting all my fish but me and him we run we took off about 196 out of 201 not the best boat number you can draw but we run down mid section of the lake Start throwing an A rig and jerk bait around, watching them all on my live live site come up and eat it. And we started, I don't know, fish for about 30 minutes and finally ended up finding a little school of them, caught two or three. Y'all can see in the video, I pulled a couple off. And at about 10 o'clock, we made a move and went on down towards the dam to some clear water. Tried that for three or four hours, I guess. And at about two o'clock, I was stuck on four fish. I had one small largemouth, a small smallmouth, one good largemouth, and another decent one. So we decided to make a run back up to the dirty water. Went up there, first spot I pulled up on, pulled up, cast that A ring up there, caught the biggest fish of the day. My co ended up catching a couple big small mouth but if they ain't over 21 you gotta throw them back so he had two probably four four and a half pound pace so he had to throw both of his back but i ended up the day with 12 pounds 12 pounds two ounces ended up 36 place got some good points on to the next in the percy priest 